Okay, uh, so we were doing a traditional ciphers and specifically we were focusing on substitution cipher and within substitution cipher we had monoalphabetic and polyalphabetic. In monoalphabetic, uh, if the letter appears multiple times in the text, in my plain text, a same let letter cipher text is being mapped to the same letter. While in polyalphabetic, uh, uh, same plain text might map to different alphabets or different letters. Uh, transposition ciphers are nothing uh, they are basically reordering the symbols or basically what we are doing we are actually reordering the way alphabet appears we're not substituting those alphabet with anything else we're just actually reordering them and in this we have two categories uh, we have a keyed transfer transposition cipher where we have some type of a key or we have keyless transposition cipher so we're going to look at those separately so let's look at keyed uh, transposition cipher so let's say uh, I have a message uh, let's say I have a message that I want to encrypt using keyed so my message is enemy attack attacks tonight all right so let's take this example and let's say I have a key for that message it's like this keyed is agreed upon so let's see so this is our key and the key is like this three you can you can have it in any way you want four five two one two three four five for encryption so this is for encryption And for decryption, we're going from top to up. All right. Okay. So here's here's how this thing is going to work. So we can have it in terms of five letters. We can have it in terms of six, three, two, whatever it is. So we're going to make a pair of five letters. So we have one, two, three, four, five. So these fives are there. One, two, three, four, five. These five letters. One, two, three, four, five. We have five one two three four and at the end uh, so we have chosen our key to be five letters so this is we're coming up with four so we're going to add a bogus character called x at the end all right so in order for me to encrypt this so the encryption for this is going to be this so encryption we're going from top to bottom so let's just to make it easier for ourselves let's write down the numbers all right so let's write down the numbers so one two three four five write down their position one two three four five one two three four five just to make it easy for ourselves one two three four five okay so we're taking this five because i have the key my key is actually five because i'm using five five one two three four five but the position since we are reordering the position i can choose that this can be chosen uh, in regards to sender and receiver okay so for encryption our encrypted letter so uh, the the third letter the third letter here would become my first letter okay so the third letter here is e so it would become my first letter the first letter that i have it becomes my second letter so this is also e all right and 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 and, and the fourth letter which is m it actually becomes my third letter so m and 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 the fifth letter fifth letter will become my fourth letter y and second letter which is this this big become my fifth letter this is how am i going to encrypt this so i'm going to come back here okay i'm going to look at so 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 this letter the first letter so the third letter the third letter would become my first letter which is t all right and 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 and, and the first letter will become my second letter which was a here and and the third uh, the fourth letter will become my third letter so fourth letter is a it becomes my third letter the fifth letter will become my fourth letter C and and the second letter will become my fifth letter D. so in this way you're gonna encrypt your 
entire message. So let me just simply write them down. H I T Z G. This is how encryption will work. Let's look at an example of a decryption in terms of keyed cipher. So this is how it's going to be. So we're going up. All right. So we're going from here to here. We're going from up. So the first letter, the first letter will become my third letter. So for for decryption, we're going from 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 here up top. So this is the arrow we're following. So the first letter, the the uh, 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 the first letter is actually my third letter. So so the first letter is E. It's my third letter. Okay. Uh, uh, the second letter is going to be my first letter, which is right here the the third letter is actually my fourth letter so so i'm just writing the position one two three four five all right so so this so one okay so the the third letter which is this guy would become my fourth letter so it will go into that position so third letter which is this it will become my fourth letter and my fourth letter one two three four fourth letter will become my fifth letter and my fifth letter, which is actually this, it becomes my second letter, which is right here. All right? Can you all see this? For decryption, we're going from top, from, from bottom up. And for encryption, we're going from top down. All right, so let's look at it. Let's write the position just to make it easy for yourself. Okay, so the first letter, this would become my third letter. So let's write now. The second letter will become my first letter. The third letter will become my fourth letter. So the third letter, which is this guy, will become my fourth letter. So one, two, three, four. All right. The fourth letter will become my fifth letter. All right. So one, two, three, four, five. And the fifth letter, which was right here, it will become my second letter. So which is this. All right. So let's pick up this guy. Let's do it one more time. So this T right here, this T, let's write down the position. One, two, three, four, five. So the first letter, all right, the first letter is actually my third letter, which is right here. The second letter is actually my first letter, all right? And my third letter is actually my fourth letter, my fourth letter is actually my fifth letter and my fifth letter which is this this becomes my second letter so can you see my 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 data start emerging and in this way we're, okay let's do this one too one two three four five okay so the first letter is actually going to be my third letter which is t all right, the second letter is going to be my first letter. Okay, so, so the second letter is going to be my first letter. So this is my I. My third letter is actually this guy. It actually becomes my fourth letter. So I'm gonna, so third is, so two nine. All right, my fourth letter, which is Z, it actually becomes my fifth letter and my fifth letter which is actually g it actually becomes my second letter all right so g g is going to be my second letter to n o i t to attacks t o n i t okay so let, let's let's do this guy again so my first letter is actually becoming my third letter so this is actually becoming my third letter this is actually becoming my third letter all right, so this is this. So let's do this. My second letter is becoming my first letter. So which is this? My third letter, which is this, this is actually becoming my fourth letter. And my fourth letter, which is this, this is becoming my fifth letter. And my fifth letter, which is this, this is actually becoming my. So this is how am I going to encrypt this letter? And this is how we actually do it in terms of key transposition cipher. So, um, so I hope you like this small tutorial on key, key transposition cipher. If you have any questions, please leave it in a comment section and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.